now we're back, and now everything appears to be fine. OBS just had itself a little mini heart attack, and apparently I needed to restart the computer to get it working properly. What are you going to do? What can you do? Mm -hmm. Alrighty then. Do, do, do. One lap around, see if we run into any people with anything to say. And then, that's where we came from. Okay. And then we're gonna go. Nothing there. The drunkards, eh? You're gonna regret your life choices! I didn't even need to see to whoop his ass. Who needed vision? Not in the restaurant, though. Feed me see more. Fatty tuna, let's go. Give me some of that. Mm. <laughs> These games are like River City Ransom on steroids. They really are, especially like these action brawler ones. It's just so, it's, it's everything I like about River City Ransom, but modernized. How's Tom holding up from COVID? He's all right, he's getting better. Oh my God, do a River City Ransom stream? I've done, I've done. River City, I, I've hit River City Ransom a few times on this channel. Uh, I probably do. River City Girls all the way through at some point because I haven't I haven't done that one all the way through on the channel. I don't even think I ever actually beat that game. Crazily enough. Played it so much, but like oh you know what it was? I, I kept starting it over with people. It, people would come over to the house and be like, yo, you play River City Girls yet? It's so good. And we started over. Yeah, Tapey, it might it might be a few weeks before we get Tom back. Uh, between you know the COVID thing and also he got he's got like some stuff coming up with work. We might not we might not see him for a while. But he'll be back. 
He always comes back. I'm still alive. You want to get hit some more? Why you want to get hit so bad? I didn't see anybody else. Oh, wait. Just as I just said it. Have a knee in your chest. Stop messing, but they never do. It's like, how many times I gotta beat the brakes off you before you realize? You ain't got the clout. Very good. I'm almost due for a Kill Bill rewatch. It's been a minute. It's been a mad minute. Pai Mei taught you the five point palm exploding heart technique. Yo, bet. Yo, he did that? Bet. 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 The five point palm exploding heart technique. Bet. Bet. Alright, let's go. We're going in. 
Time to advance the story. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Gotta put on the shades. Let's go. いらっしゃいませ。お一人様ですかああ。すみません。ただいま満席でして、少々待っていただいてもお構いませんでしょうか。構えへん、待つ。ほんま、すみません。そしたらこちらでお待ちください。よろしければお飲み物もお持ちし
誰かこうてくれへんかな<笑>逆に見ついてもらうつもりないやろそうなん優しいお客さんおらんもんなあなあ今ならうちにプレゼントするチャンスやでああせやサンタさんにでもお願いしやちゃんと靴下も用意しとかなあかんでもうお客さん行けずやわええもん自分で買うからそれはもう、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、あそない必死になって同伴させるほど景気悪そうには見えへんけどな単に意地張ってるだけですわ意地最近客の入りでグランドに負けっぱなしやさかい今月は絶対に勝たな全員罰金とかむちゃくちゃ言わはりますねんなんやそら自分とこが儲かっとればそれでええやないかなんでグランドが関係あんねんうちもそう思うんやけどな支配人はそう思ってへんみたいで正直なんぼ同伴したって常連さんも毎日何十万も使ってくれるわけとちゃうし新規のお客さんを増やさへんと頭打ちないよねほうなるほどなそれにしてもこの店は可愛い子がぎょうさん揃っとるの全部で何人くらいおるんやそう100人くらいおるんとちゃうかな今日は40人くらいやと思いますけどほんなら知らん子も多いんやろなせやな週に一度しかこん子とかもおるし同じ席について初めて話したっちゅうケースもしょっちゅうですそない信号がよう入ってくるんかさすがに人気店はちゃうのちゃいますそんだけ辞める子が多いんです辞めるなんでうちは上下関係めっちゃ厳しいですしちょっとでも人気でそうな子が入るとすぐ上が潰しにかかるんですわ競争が激しいっちゅうことかせやけどそない中でも人気ある子っちゅうんはほんまにすごい子なんやろなそうですねナンバーワンののぞみさんなんか毎日開店と同時に目当てのお客さんがひっきりなしに来てますわそののぞみっちゅう子はどんな子なんやのぞみさんですかうーんほんまはお客さんに他の子のこと話したらあんまりよくないんやけどまあ一言で言うと真面目な人ですわ真面目そのお客さんの中には銀行のお偉いさんとか政治家の先生とかも多いんですわせやからうちらそないな人と話し合わせるために新聞やニュースをいつもチェックしとけって店からうるさく言われてるんですのぞみさんは特に真面目でやる気のある人やからそういうお客さんから受けがよくて指名をたくさん稼いでいったんです名実ともにトップレディッチわけやなほんなら人気が出んのも当然やなあーせやけどこの前若いお客さんが来た時は逆に全然話題についていかれへんくてめっちゃ面白かったですわあ今の内緒にしてなうちがそないなこと言ってたのが他の子にバレたら大変なことになってしまうから<笑>安心しいや誰にも言わへんって可愛いとこがあるやないかそののぞみちゃんもん
Perhaps we needed more disguise than a pair of glasses. おでっせの試合に自ら置いてになるとは恐縮やのう。すまんの。ちょっと外してもらえるか。おめえ宛ては望みやね。さすがはうちとタメハル店の試合に。話が早くて助かるわ。あんたの方は随分と<笑> <さすがはうちとタメハル店の試合に。笑> そこそ忍び込んで敵情を示唆。それがあんたのやり方か。そないなことせんでも望みに会いたきゃ呼びますせ。説得でも交渉でもしたらええ。そないなことしても、トップのあんたが運と言わな。答えを動か。俺が説得
別にそっちだけが特攻する話でもないでなるほどなあんたは顔に似合わず敵作らんとうまいことやる方法を知っとるらしいこれがマジマゴロウのやり方っちゅうわけか交渉成立ってことでいいなええー、でしょうただあんたんとことうちはライバルや今日みたいなのはこれ限りにしてもらいましょうかこれからはうちも全力で勝ちに行かせてもらいます覚悟はええな<笑>好きにぜやさてっとええ酒飲ませてもろうたおがんじょう頼むわ<笑>勉強させてもらいましたからね今日は私の大ごりっちゅうことでそらごちそうさほなプラットフィキンズ。With intrigue。本当ですかああ。なんとか引き抜き成功や。いつもいつもどうやってそんな。まあ、いろいろあんね。望みのシフトとか詳しいことは明日話そう。わかりました。お疲れ様です。Quick pause for the cause. I need to pee.
Oh shit, HM Radio Live. I live out there. <clears throat> what is this? I love wrestling, but boy, do I hate the fans. Fickle idiots. For the story and psychological understanding of used toilet paper and the business acumen sterilized of a sterilized frog with an M80 up its ass. Wow. Tell them how you really feel, Stevie. Well, it's what set you off this time. Mm, I could go, yeah. I uh, think this behind me is probably faster. Mm. Mm. This morning, I just heard somebody try to get my attention. Hmm. Perhaps I was mistaken. Feel like people profess to love pro wrestling and then all they do is hate it. Uh, it's not critical thinking if 90% of what you do is shit on it. Fuck off and watch something else, you toad troll bitches. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think I think there is some element of like the you know bitching about the minutia is part of it. Um, and it's totally okay to have a preference and you know have have uh, styles or presentations that you prefer but like adding toad troll bitches to my vernacular as we speak thank you steve <laughs> um you know yeah i, I think i think it, that comes down to like just fucking Hanging out with the right crowd. Like, we had a great WrestleMania weekend. You know? We, we we didn't enjoy every single second of both shows. We had plenty to say. But overall, it was fun and enjoyable and, and nice to watch the spectacle of pro wrestling be the spectacle of pro wrestling. You know? <laughs> You hate watch something else. Hate watching really does seem to be it's it's the weirdest thing. I don't know. I think it's all about finding your finding your if you like wrestling, find your groove with wrestling, you know? Like for me, I, I burn out if I watch if I was trying to watch every weekly show from from both from both major companies, sprinkle in some other stuff, I would be so burnt out that I wouldn't want to watch at all. So I just watch the big events, catch up on the storylines that way, and then I enjoy wrestling and I don't have to pick or choose or hate one to like the other, you know what I mean? You get a lot of like some weird sense of loyalty thing, like you gotta hate WWE to like AEW or vice versa. It's like it's nonsense. Could just enjoy like I enjoy when there's good wrestling and good storytelling. Like 
That's all. It's very simple. I like good wrestling, good storytelling. I like matches that tell a story in the ring that makes sense with what's going on in the larger narrative. You know? And, uh, and w when it's done well, it's like still one of my favorite things to enjoy. When it's not, it's very disappointing. But, like, I don't know. I think if you're going to be a lifelong wrestling fan, you have to reach the point where you're just like, I like that wrestling exists and I'm always, like, going to, even if I'm not necessarily in love with what's going on, I'm always going to, like, look over the fence, you know, be like, hey, what's going what, let me peek in today, see what's happening, you know? Yeah. Adam. See, and here's the funny thing about that episode two is my favorite of the prequels <laughs> so there you go That's, but again, it, it, it's funny that you brought up Star Wars because it's a perfect comparison. Star Wars, Star Wars has done many things that I don't like. It's done many things that I wouldn't have done if I had the, if I had the Star Wars pencil. I would have done many different things to what they did and put out. But you know what? I'm still happy Star Wars exists. I'm always ready to check out the next thing and see if it's good. Some things come out and I like them. Some things come out and I don't. And that's fine. Like... I don't know. It's, it ain't for all that, you know? Like, I would never want to live in a world where AEW becomes the number one brand of wrestling, let's say, and puts WWE out of business. Like, I would never want to live in that world. I just lived in that world for fucking 25 years. Like, I like it better when there's multiple options, Preferably with different styles and different presentations and different approaches to the thing, you know, and I want to be able to I like, again, I don't, I don't I don't have to choose one or the other. I don't have to hate one to love the other. It's like I could just watch and enjoy and watch and enjoy. And when I'm burnt out, watch a little less. If I'm enjoying one a little more than the other, watch a little more of one and a little less of the other. Like, it's totally fine. Mm. And even the discourse is fine when it's like, you know, grounded in something. Like when Eric was up in here yesterday just being like, yeah, that show was garbage, whatever. I'm like, that's crazy. How could you watch that WrestleMania and come out of that with it was garbage? 
Like I can't I can't believe that somebody would actually feel that way. But at the same time, if that's how you feel, then that's how you feel, you know? I don't know. It's just, you know, it's it's, it's all very it's all wild. There absolutely is something about wrestling fandoms, you know? It's just that it's just weird. Nah, man. Talk to that dude. Get some weapons. Learn some stuff. Oh, let's go. Gotta put it in the build. Let's go, boys. Mr. Stefano Hames putting it in the build now. You love to see it. Blap. There it is. Ah. Custom weaponry. I like the sound of that.
Okay. Let's do it. But you know, there's one thing all wrestling fans can agree on, regardless of personal preference. It's that Jedi showed the heart of a champion on Couch Mania Night 2. the fuck out of Chef Suplex. He was resilient. He had the heart of a champion. Yeah. Uh, nah, you know what? Here, we'll put a hundred bucks on there. Knock off three seconds. K buys me five seconds and a hundred bucks buys me three seconds. All right, well, do it just like that. Have a hundred bucks. <laughs> Squid Raid, I ain't got no ding, but I'll play you one of these. You think all me am is me tits? Let's go, boys. <laughs> Hit him with a Hit him with a wigwam. You know, sometimes I think I'm a wigwam. Wigwam. Clean. Hit him with a... Look at how clean. Hit him with a... We them clean boys. And you know what? Why don't we hit him with one of these? You eat babies. Let's go. And you know what? You know what really applies today. Let's hit him with one of these. Where is it? Do, 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 was just thinking of playing this game. Oh, I'm having a great time. The game is fantastic. Uh. Loves me some Yakuza. Hi. How's everybody doing today? Okay, let's go. On this Wednesday of Thursday proportions, what were you playing? Why are you all oh, look at this! Here? Dropping the gifties. I wish I had the belt. Bing, 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 bing. Got it. Let's go. Poke. Oh, poke. You playing the Pokemans? Let's go. Let's go. I ain't got no Pokemon experience. Let's see. We got a uh, Robbie Deuce. Deuce got a sub. That's big. Wee's got a sub. That's big. Wee's is like the world class, the king lurker of all king lurkers. Oni Batman got a sub. Let's go. Love to see that. General Beauregard got a sub. Let's go. Tom like a bomb. See, I'm just being just hit heavyweights. Let's go. Let's go. Why are you always here? You love to see it. Never actually beat a Pokemans? Yeah, me neither. I played like a little bit of one of them. I, I could definitely see the appeal. But uh, never, never sat down and played all the way through one. The doll girl, eh? It is coming together. 
Uh-uh, thank you for noticing. Yeah, we got the we got the bookshelf behind us. We still haven't painted the living room, but we're getting there little by little. <laughs> we got the couch. That was the big get. And it's comfortable. Matter of fact, right after this here stream, I might done have to take me a little uh, napski right on that couch. I was talking about wrestling and how you Brooklyn boys got me into it. Oh, really? Have have you have you been perusing? This 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 is this is potentially news to me. As as Misha at Misa as Misha once so elegantly put it, wrestling is like real life anime. <laughs> <laughs> and it's delightful. <laughs> it can be silly, over the top, and ridiculous. And then every once in a while, you, you come across a good story that hits you right in the feels. Yeah, we just had a big, big wrestling themed weekend with WrestleMania and Couchomania. I like that they've given me a bat now. This 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 speaks to my sensibilities. This man, Majima just trying to go to his house and get some sleep. Yo, you saw the D the D D movie? Okay, 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 okay. Hold on. See now I gotta put the controller down for a second. So Misha and I last month went to see Cocaine Bear and had a ridiculous fun time watching that ridiculous, pretty terrible movie in the movie theaters. It was great. Great time was had by all. And then we were like, all right, that was fun. Now I'm like, I feel like the next time a movie comes around that makes it to the theater that looks like it might be real stupid, we should probably go because that was a good time. So I saw the, the like, posters up for the D&D &D movie, and I was like, and then I, of course, immediately thought to the early 2000s D&D &D movie, and I was like, well, that was the biggest piece of dookie ever. So I was like, that would be perfect. So, but then, to my surprise, this new D&D &D movie is getting some decent reviews. So, so, let, so let me get the squid review of the D&D &D movie. <laughs> Um, John Wick, I mean, I saw the other John Wick, so I assume I know what I'm getting there. Was a legit 10 out of 10. Let's go. Let's go. 10 out. Masterpiece. Oh, boy. Right off the rip here, huh? <laughs> no dates. No quaffy. No walks in the park. Just right to it. All right. Excellent, excellent, excellent. That see, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> Why 
Oh man. Oh man. Oh man. Where do we go here? I mean, we could nudge immediately into the friend zone. You know what I'm saying? Like, be like, yo, you know, you're coming on a little strong. You know what I'm saying? We could go down not into the ladies' route, or we could take this middle path and return serve. Oh yeah, oh yeah. You want you you want to come out come out the gate being like, let's hold hands and buy flowers. I'm like, fuck it, let's go to the chapel. Go with the the chapel and we's go on again. May yay yay read. You know. Yeah, repost her a question. That's what I'm saying, right? I feel, I feel like we gotta. I love y'all motherfuckers right, right in with it. Everybody's like two, two right off the... All right, double down. You know what? Split it, double down. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> yes. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, you don't have the courage of your convictions. I see how it is. I see how it is. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Can't have nice things. Oh my god, that's so stupid. Oh, see, see, you have ulterior motives. I was out here ready to put my heart, and you and you out here just running a flim flam operation. You see, Hi. that ain't love. Okay, now how in the world? <laughs> Repost. <laughs> oh no. I love, okay, so Squid, I don't know if you have previous Yakuza game experience, but one of the things that really makes me love these games is that the main story is always full of like intrigue and betrayal and like really really gets you hooked into what's going on and then all the side uh, side stories are just clown shoes so it's like a perfect balance of like when you're side questing it's completely ludicrous and then when you're when you go down the main path it's like really gripping compelling shit so it's perfect it's like it's got the right balance between gooning out and giving you a good story i love it Oh, absolutely. Let's go. Could you be my pretend boyfriend? I told my dad that he was a streamer with a striped red and black beanie, soul patch, and a singer in a band. 
<laughs> Yo, are you kidding me? I'm like, well, I guess I gotta do it. jump straight at the giggle part bonding you can only pretend to uh, <laughs> you gotta <laughs> you gotta fart immediately <laughs> second interaction rip one that is that is the most the most real <laughs> that you could be with a person break down that wall as fast as possible serve them egg salad on the third date Sit in the living room and just blast. Just go ahead. That's how you'll know it's love. <laughs> Take it easy, Squid. Uh, thanks for sending the homies over. Uh, I'll be sending them somewhere else shortly. I gotta go take care of Misha. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending. And don't anger him. Oh, we are so gonna anger him. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Hold their hands, look into their eyes, and just say, I'm sorry, and rip, rip a cabbage fart. Ah! <laughs> cabbage fart. I ate a bean burrito directly before I came over. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's great. I mean, that's the way you do it. Again, if you if you just like completely just like no hesitation, just just let it go and she stays with you, that's good stuff. That's that you're learning the right lessons at that point. You you're knowing you're knowing that there's something there. You know what I'm saying? If if she if she can't handle you or your smelly is, you ain't got no chance. God, I gotta be in on the backstory. Six months, a dentist. Oh my God, that fourth night at Bonnaroo stank. <laughs> Let's go, boys. <laughs> yeah, I just played three games of racquetball. You know, <laughs> right off the rip. Okay, I'm a dentist. I like going out on drives and watching movies. Okay, I got one other, one out of three of those. You know. And your favorite food is the omelet rice I make. Omelet rice. Okay, let's go. All right, we've been the last six months. I'm a dentist. I like going on drives and watching movies. And I love the omelet rice. Boom. Let's go. This is not what I thought I'd be doing when I found out I was going to play as Majma. Take this so bad. No, 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 no. We're gonna step up. We're gonna step up. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Above board. Above board. At least, at least off the rip. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> if I leave it up to y'all, I know where this is going. So, I'm not calling him father. 
We're not gonna, we're gonna back off of that. We're not telling them to make my miso soup. We're gonna go. She's gonna say, pleased to meet you. Boom. Clean. Oh, look at this. Okay, okay, here we go. Okay. Yeah, let's go. All right. Okay. Okay, here we go. Okay. The job. Oh, shit. Okay. <sighs> okay. Oh, man. I'm, I'm torn on this. I kind of, I mean, I know that we could just, we could just, <laughs> we could explode this or we can nail it down. You know what I'm saying? We can nail it down. We could pretend to be a dentist right now. The real, the actual answer is I manage a cabaret. Mm. All right, do we play this baby face or do we start the heel turn? What are we doing? Three? Oh boy, <laughs> I'm not, but I'm not even a yakuza. Okay, all right, all right, we got threes. Anybody else? <laughs> oh no, we're gonna blow it up. <laughs> we're gonna blow it up, boys. Ooh, going once. Going twice. Anybody want to make a case for any of the other choices? Oh, God. Going chicken soup with rice. No, I guess. All right. Tapey's taking us to oblivion. Let's go. I'm a Yakuza. <laughs> okay, a joke. Here we go. Stopped me in the street. This is what actually happened. We sat next to each other at a movie is what she wants me to say. Now you play it smooth. Okay, all right. Okay, 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 okay. Sat next to each other at a movie. Boom. Let's go.
Oh boy. Oh no. All right, let's go. She's so cute. She makes great omelet rice. She's innocent and childlike. I prefer not to pick three. Yes, definitely not three. That's... All right, the omelet rice is clearly the answer to go with. Or do we lean on the cute factor? Coin flip. All right, do I, don't do I have a coin nearby? I don't think I do. All right, here, we'll do, we'll do it like this. Boom, she's cute. <laughs> oh man, it's completely superficial. <laughs> Since he came out, he came out straight. We'll be real. We'll be real. Let her be who she is. I wonder if she'd have given me a better item if we got it all, if we like nailed the performance. <laughs> oh, 
hilarious. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> I'm enjoying playing as Majima so much. Holy shit. Swing by the dragon and tiger, eh? Which is here, right? Oh no, that's the apartment. Where the heck is the dragon and tiger? Alright, uh, well. Is this it right here? No, arcade. That's gonna be another quest. Dragon and tiger is right there. Alright, I'm just gonna save for now and we'll pick up here. Man, the action is hot and fucking heavy in Seltonberry. Let's go. Man, I got a feeling like every game in this series is going to be fantastic. Because I've only played bits of like four games. And all of one, a big chunk of another, however much I've done of this one, and then a little bit of the very first one. And they, well, no, and the Fist of the North Star game. And they've all been fantastic. So I think this series just rocks. <laughs> it's, it's just a lot of fun. All right. Well, thanks for hanging, everybody. I'm going to send y'all somewhere. Let's see who's doing what. And where can I send y'all? Yeah, I'm, I'm in the middle of Judgment. I've played a lot of Judgment. Like, that's been one of my free time games for a while now. That game's great. I love it. I'm a, I'm a sucker for detective stories in general. So that game is uh, definitely doing it for me. All right. Uh, none of the homies are on, so let's go see. Well, we'll go see Black Blade. Why not? The always entertaining Black Blade. Be good people. Do good things. Have mine radio tonight at 9. Peace, 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 peace. Later, peace. Thank you for all the new love today. Squid, thank you for the raid. Take it easy. Take it breezy. Take it any way you can get it. Peace.